Hi, this message is for Jake Thomas. I'm calling regarding your application. I'm sorry, but we are no longer uh, accepting any positions. Thank you for your time this and good Chris luck to Deacon you. This is Chris Deacon from The Cage. I'm sorry to inform you that we are no longer accepting positions for this role. This is Janice Kelly from Thank Strikers you. Good day. Inc. I'm sorry to inform you that we are no longer hiring at this time. Hey, hey. You got a light? I think you could use one. It just seems like the city don't care about degrees or experience or anything, you know? Yeah, well, it's not what you know, but who you know. And what doesn't kill you is just gonna make you stronger. Yeah, I guess. So, uh, you're here all by yourself, no family, no friends. It's just me. But man, I gotta go. I got some stuff to do. All right. Hey. Yeah. You wanna get a drink sometime? Uh, yeah. Sometime. See you later. Why can't, Why can't I, sleep? I sleep? I can't even tell. I can't my even tell my eyes, eyes are, are, open are open or closed. closed. But I know I'm but not. I know I'm not sleeping. Hey, neighbor. Up for those drinks? Yeah. Uh, I don't think now's the best time, but Come on, it's, it's a fresh start for both of us. Let's start it right. Come on. Just a little while. All right. Jake, I know you're going through a rough time right now, you know, uh, but I'm really glad that you're my new neighbor. To friendship. To friendship. And I really appreciate you coming over here, man. You seem like a real stand-up guy. Not like all the other tools in the world. But like the government? <laughs> Them too. But pretty much anybody who makes a living screwing over other people, leaving guys like me in the dirt. Yeah. What are you gonna do? I'll tell you what I like to do. Kill him. Wouldn't that be nice? Anything's possible. I like to kill them all and take all their bitches. You know what's wrong with the world? Women are huge roadblocks in life. Not all women get in the way. <laughs> what are you talking about? You are drowning in your own misery because of a woman. Um, don't forget about unemployment, asshole. <laughs> unemployment. Yeah, you, know, you could go down to the corner and charge ten bucks a BJ. <laughs> More. I'm sorry. I'm, I'll get. I'm getting that. Sorry, I don't even know what happened. That was hilarious. You didn't have to place this shot. I know, I'm sorry. I'll buy you a shot next week. How are you going to buy me a shot? You can't even find yourself a job. You know what, dude? I, I got something to do in the morning. I should go to bed. What? Jake. Um, Jake. I'll see you around. I was just kidding, chill out. It was just it was just a joke. I'll see you around. Fine. I should just end it all. I should just end it all. Right. 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 That's awesome. Yeah, I'll text you the address to the office. Can you be here in 30? Yeah, yeah, I can do that. So, what is this place? Come on, I'll show you. Jesus Christ!
Rice, what the hell is this? You got a dude tied to a chair in the middle of a fucking garage. What am I supposed to do? You are going to kill this person. <laughs> Bullshit, I'm not killing anybody. Remember what you told me? This is just another leech on society taking away from what should be yours. I can't just kill somebody. <laughs> that's not what you said. And that's not what I promised our final contestant in the chair. Jake. If you don't take care of your problems, <laughs> Your problems are going to take care of you. Are you waiting for? Do it! There is nothing so small that it can't be blown out of proportion. And I really appreciate you coming over here. Seems like a real stand-up guy. i kill them all, and i take all their bitches. I can't tell my eyes are hopeless, but I'm definitely not sleeping.